Good morning. <laughs> so on this beautiful morning, I picked, you know, one of my beautiful Meyer lemons. This is just one of them. It's not the biggest one. I just grabbed it, but I just want to share, look how gorgeous that is. And wait until I cut into it. It's all juice. Beautiful. All right. So it's that time of week again where I make my big old slab of salmon. So here it is. <laughs> Isn't that gorgeous? Yes, it is. Anyway, I get this at um, Costco. And um, I do this every week. And then I eat off of it all week long. Salmon is so good for you. The other thing I buy at Costco that I love and eat every day is garlic. So I buy it in the big old jugs like this. And I just, I cook it in the oven. I roast it with a little salt and pepper and a little aluminum foil. And I eat off of it. It's really, really good for your cholesterol. And it's wonderful for you. Um, so the other thing I'm, I'm using is lots of herbs from my garden. Some of them store-bought because... You know, my, my dill is, is growing, but it's not there yet. One thing I love that is so good, um, the Thai basil. Oh, God, why is it so much better than regular basil? Anyway, I, I got some yesterday because we ordered some of that fuss soup for the boys. I need to um, grow it, but I've got, like, um, onion from my garden and um, lots of rosemary from my garden that I sat here before I started the video and, and picked off the... Them. Um, these little chili pecans. Ooh, they're hot. <laughs> I got a couple of those in there. Anyway, um, and then my lemons from the tree. I love to cook with stuff that I grow, and I grow lots and lots of things. So, um, if you push everything together when you're chopping, it um, chops makes things easier. So squish it all together. And this makes a lot of herbs, but let me tell you, um, when I'm making my sauce to go with this, it's gonna, I'll use a lot of them in there too. So. And when you get to the little peppers, you really wanna make sure you get those going because um, you don't wanna bite into them. They're those little bitty chili pecan peppers are hot yeah really want to make sure I, I get them good yeah. alright so I've got some herbs I've got my um let's see Don't, well, you don't come in here if you don't have on clothes. <laughs> All right. I've got my garlic. Sometimes um, I chop it. And today I'm thinking, no, you know what? I'm just going to use my little thing because I don't like to, when I'm doing um, the salmon, I don't want to bite into big pieces of garlic. And this, I think, is going to work really nice. But I like using lots of garlic on everything. So how y'all doing today? <laughs> All right. Oops. All right. Some lemon zest. Always use your zest and your juice. The zest, you're gonna get, you know, all the big lemony flavors. And then I've got, um, what? No, no, no. Go put clothes on. Don't come in here, please. You want a car? Now I've got pepper that I just ground up, freshly cracked black pepper. 
and my salt. Okay, I'm gonna use, do y'all see this, how pretty? Can you see the, yeah. Isn't that beautiful salt? I have um, pink and black salt. And the black is that this beautiful um, salt from Hawaii. It's gorgeous. All right, um, so that looks good. I'm gonna put some olive oil in there. be today's so you know like I said I always you know I like to change it up but um this is a good way to make your salmon um it's very simple you can use whatever herbs you like whatever ones you know that you've got um and then what I'll do is I'll eat all every day I'll cut off a little portion of it and then I pan fry it. I like to put a little salt at the bottom of my thing. And then the other thing that's good is put some lemon slices under it. So let's cut some lemon. Beautiful. To sit under. a little oil down okay salt and pepper both sides of your salmon easy peasy Just salt and peppered it. Let's see. All right. That's my good stuff. And you just want to work it in. Now, some um, fun things to do that I sometimes do is I, I cut slits in the uh, salmon and I stuff anchovies in the slits. That's fun. I'm not gonna do that this time. But, um, that's beautiful. And you wanna pat it down in there. Just, there you go. All right. That is ready. Now, you can cook this in the oven. You can cook it on the grill. You can smoke it, which is kind of what I've been doing lately. And I, um, I may do that today, or maybe I'll just do it on the grill. Um, Cause I think I need to order some more wood chips and stuff. All right. <laughs> anyway, I wanted to share that with you. This is beautiful. And it's, you know, once you cook it, This, this is delicious, just like that. Or you can do what I do, and you know, if you wanna portion it off and eat some each day, and then you pan fry it, and then you, or you can cook it up different ways. I make salmon ceviche, salmon tacos, salmon cocktails. No, I don't do that. <laughs> anyway, bye y'all. <laughs>